along with my wife, Jill, here this morning. It's uh, March 27, Tuesday, March 27, two weeks from today is Election Day. And I wanted to come live and have you get to know Jill a little bit, because everybody knows me, and uh, it's kind of hard when you're the face for a campaign and everybody gets to know the candidate, but uh, I wanted to get you to know my wife. So you also notice that in the background, we didn't clean up or anything. This is our real life right now. Um, in fact, our kids are probably going to come walking through here at, at any time because they're off for Easter break this week. So, um, so Jill, tell um, the people about yourself. You know, everyone knows me, but but who are you? What what's your backstory? Sure. Well, I grew up in Northwest Iowa and came to school at uh, Southeast here in town. Graduated with graphic design and worked for a year at then Sioux Valley, now Sanford. Worked there for a year before I decided to go back to school and started classes at USF until I met someone that lured me to Dort College. <laughs> but um, yeah, graduated um, from Dort and then um, worked at some nonprofits in town and also worked um, at software company and banking um, and now back to another nonprofit. So, um Jill and I have been married 18 years. We got married in 2000, or excuse me, 99. Uh, we were very young. We were 21. Um, and uh, we were married in uh, Rock Valley, Iowa, uh, after our junior year of college. And uh, then we moved to Sioux Falls right after we finished college. So, so Jill, what about like, uh, you know, people know the causes I'm passionate about in Sioux yeah. Falls. What are some of the things that you like? You know, I know you're on boards and stuff. Tell right. people what right. causes you're involved with. Uh, currently, I'm on the Bethany board, Bethany Christian Services. And um, we're passionate about um, something they have going on there called Safe Families. And um, that mission is, is true to our heart. And um, also Dress for Success. I'm a volunteer there. love their mission and what they're doing for women in Sioux Falls. And also, I am um, managing a thrift store, which the profits go to uh, tuition assistance at Sioux Falls Christian Schools. So those are the things that I'm kind of passionate about at the moment. So what was, and these are not scripted questions. She doesn't even know the script. Nora, come over here. Yeah. Nora's, Nora's <laughs> talking to us in the background. Uh, what was your reaction when I told you three, four years ago, I said, Jill, um, I'm really feeling called and led to run for mayor of Sioux Falls. What was your reaction on that? That didn't surprise me at all. Um, in fact, when um, we were in the decision of are we going to do this, are we not, I just really felt that when I looked at all the qualities of a good candidate, I couldn't think of anyone better for the job. Straight from the horse's mouth. I mean, you know, great endorsement right there. I would expect her to say nothing else. Okay. So to, to kind of wrap it up, um, yeah, I wanted you just to meet Jill, but I'm going to give you some rapid-fire questions. She doesn't know any of these rapid-fire questions. I made them up. Uh, so, um, yeah, I won't embarrass you. We'll start with this one. Uh, your favorite TV show? Uh, this is Us. This is Us. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Typical soccer mom right here. This is Us. Uh, your beverage of choice? Oh, Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew. I'm trying to kick it, but... Regular yeah. Mountain Dew. Um, the chore around the house that you despise the most? The kitchen. The dishes. The dishes. Definitely. I'll co-sign on that. Uh, your favorite NFL quarterback? <laughs> <laughs> uh, because it's the only one I know. An old one, Joe Montana. <laughs> Joe Montana. Okay. It's supposed to be Kirk Cousins. Oh, he's, Kirk Cousins. Yes. yes. He's a Vikes quarter. Yes. Uh, and last question. Um, who are you voting for on April 10th? Have you made up your mind yet? Or um, so? You know, if he plays his cards right, I think he's going to be Paul. <laughs> Oh, so uh, hopefully uh, you'll you'll see Jill at some events, and if you haven't already, uh, come up and introduce yourself to her. If you see her at an event, she's a very personable young lady, and uh, she's been yeah. a rock for me on this campaign, and uh, just a wonderful, wonderful support uh, support person in me in this journey. So thanks. Uh, we'll do more of these to get to know uh, maybe my kids. If you want to get to know them, they're downstairs yelling right now. So uh, thanks. Make it a great day, and I uh, hope to see you on the campaign trail in the next two weeks. Bye-bye.